I still got 46 seconds. I still got 46 seconds. Alexa, shut your mouth. Look at the view. Have you tried the amber one? You literally in the corner. I'm like, look at the view. <laughs> My voice is gone from the vineyard yesterday. And I was just thinking, why the hell is your voice gone from a vineyard? When we were at the vineyard, we were sitting near the DJ booth, so we had to scream and shout and let it all out to hear each other, even the slightest bit. So my voice has just completely vanished. Well, actually, my voice was fine this morning, and then took a nap, woke up, and I sounded like this. But I sound so sexy, so I don't care. <clears throat> anyway, I was showing you guys that instead of putting white on my inner, my outer corners, I put this light purple by Pixie. This is in shade Lush Lavender. And I kind of just did it to be silly and it looks cute. I wanted to do another wig install for YouTube, but the last one flopped. So I'm wondering if people are like even interested in that. So let me know if that was something you guys wanted or not, or if you want them to stay being fused into vlogs, because I just want to know like the best way to go about them, I guess. I and mean, it just seems like maybe as, a, as its own video. You guys didn't love that. Let me know. Also, I have a gaming video coming up, but it's being edited by, oh my gosh, I got so distracted. It's being edited right now, actually, so I don't know if it's gonna go up before you even see this. If it's up already, go watch that. I don't know which side she puts it on. I'm playing You're Not My Neighbor because I tried to play that a couple months ago and I accidentally downloaded it in Japanese. I'm gonna try something crazy. Let's just see. Let's just see. What's that gonna do? Whoa, doesn't look bad. It looks kind of cool. This makeup looks so cunty, but this, uh, the Fenty Easy Drop is a little too warm because you can see it's like stopping. And then there's my neck. So I'm gonna put some down my neck because this looks wavy. And I'm about to do a review of the Sony E10 for TikTok, but I wanted to show you guys too. So I'll be jumping in and out to show you guys. Is that even doing anything? I need a warm body. Have you guys seen that movie? Warm bodies, the zombie thing, and it's like a comedy, like a rom-com, I think. I haven't watched it in a long time. Oh, it looks so glowy. This is the Kimchi Beauty Highlight Duo. That thing is is hot, like the light is high. Also, Max sent me the, the Lip Trio PR package where there's Ryan Destiny's Lip Duo, and then there were two other beautiful women, I just do not remember what it said on the package. So I kind of want to try these. I got a couple wigs to try. Oh my gosh, I sat on it. That's what a big fat ass do. I haven't washed any of these just because I don't know if I'm even gonna wear one. So we're gonna feel it out first and just see. Wow. And I deserve that. Complicated ass box, like you're messing up my thing. This lace looks good. What the hell? Move. Let me get that, that not concealer cause um, <laughs> this shit worked. So we're gonna try it. I'm just gonna um, sanitize them for now. Cause even if I like one, I'm not gonna install them until I wash it. Whoa, whoa. I never thought I'd see the day <laughs> that I would like not only a black bust down, but a middle part. I'm a fraud. Like, wait, oh my gosh. Wait, this might be the one I pick. So let me take it off. <laughs> She's kind of sexy. She might have to get washed right now in the washer. I don't know, I'm gonna like this one. I don't know, I'm not feeling this one and I haven't even put it on yet. <laughs> now it's not giving, oh now I can tell she's West Indian. It's not giving that. I thought it was gonna give like tropical vacation, cutie. Maybe she'll look good after she's washed. Now the one that I really think I'm gonna like, the blonde bombshell. Oh, the lace look good on this. Now she's exactly what I was looking for for the summer. A cute, short bob. So I'm excited. Wait, she could be the one. She could be the one. She's popping. Wait, this is the bob I was looking for for the summer. I was looking for the perfect summer bob. I found her. Oh my gosh. And then I cut here. So it gives. Oh, come on. This is the most that I've liked out of a batch of wigs that I was unsure about. So, that's cool. Then we've got Miss Draculaura. I need to find a side part Draculaura color themed wig because I'm supposed to cosplay her soon. And the middle parts ain't working for me. I might just have to wear it on a slant. 
Why do Vice wigs make my head look pointy? That's why I can't get behind them. Just like, what's with this? Why can't it lay like that? What's with that? But damn, this is pretty. Wasn't expecting to gag. Um, and you know what? For Dracula or cosplay, boom. Okay, wait. I'm gagged a bit. I moved. I moved. People died. Definitely not the favorite, but I'm not mad at her. Okay, I'm washing. I'm washing all the wigs that I just tried on for four, 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 the four different wigs, and I'm washing them all right now. And when my sister was here, she was putting wigs on the counter laid out, and I'm like, damn, your ass is smart, so that they can all dry the same. That's genius. So that's what I'm about to do. Um, we're gonna go to Whole Foods, we got some returns to do. Discovering Whole Foods returns is the best thing that I've ever done. I literally could not believe how easy it is. I was, I was a frequent return keeper because what do you mean I have to go to the post office, print out a label, find a box? No! So as soon as I realized Whole Foods is literally just going there and giving that shit to somebody or dropping it off? Yes! Like what? I used to really just keep anything I didn't want or that was broken or whatever. And that was it. Like that's all I got. Like I'm not, I'm not going to do all that. I'm not going to do all that. It was ridiculous and it was not smart to do. I was literally wasting so much freaking money doing that. So now I'm a, I'm a, I'm a Whole Foods return girl. And it's a nice reason for me to go outside. Y'all know I don't be going outside. It was fun today though, we played so much Roblox. We played Among Us, oh my gosh, they changed the game so much. There's so much different stuff on there now. Okay, we gotta go. Almost out of my soul digital you know, 71, but we gotta go because we are trying to ship this package to Nia before seven um, and it's 6.30. I'm just dying quite quickly, but I'm making dinner. I've been doing so good going to sleep early. It's 9.06, today was cleaning day, so I'm freaking winded, but I'm making some scallops. I, I have these two jumbo scallops right here. I just cut up on my violin, so I'm in a great mood. It's one of, we're getting to the end, so it's one of those episodes where everyone's just in love, and Kenny and Janae closed things off. I ripped my scallop. The heck, it's, well, I did thaw it out um, in lightning speed, because I didn't, I forgot I had to make dinner today, so I didn't have nothing thought out. So I did the cold water moment, and um, it literally ripped my scallop apart. <laughs> well, this one's strong. She's resilient. Her um, her boyfriend, not so much. I mean, realistic, so. Okay, um, so I'm gonna cook down. The minute rice, I just put a drizzle of milk in there. I literally just take a little bit, like I'm talking literally a dash, 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 dash. Boom, that's it, that's it, that's all you need. The oil is popping, hold on. I think this, it's ready for the scallops. Okay, hot oil. OMG. Gordon, I'm gonna make you so proud. Alexa, set a timer for two minutes. <laughs> ooh, ooh. It's getting everywhere, it's getting everywhere. Alexa, what should the internal temperature be of a cooked scallop? We still got 46 seconds. And then we finna flip it. And then we finna flip it. A, A, A. My man, she's my alibi. Alibi. Okay, I'ma flip them, I'ma flip them. Ah! Okay, wait, it looks good so far. It don't look crazy. Hey, 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 hey. Alexa, turn off the timer. Alexa, set another timer for two minutes. I'm overwhelmed, I'm overwhelmed, I'm overwhelmed. Too much happening. I'm overwhelmed. I'm taking it off. You're done. Okay. That was really easy um, and not stressful at all. Here's the scallops. Um, I hope that's a good scallop. She's my alibi. Stop. It said that scallops are good with risotto. I have minute rice. I don't have risotto. Same thing, so. Um, I hope this is freaking delicious. I'm so scared of this scallop. What if it's undercooked? Gordon, this one's for you. It doesn't really look cooked. It tastes like a fish. I don't know what that means. You guys are literally about to die, but I wanted to make sure you see the smoothie. Scared. I'm so scared. If this tastes bad, I'm gonna be really pissed. And I knew it was gonna be good. I'm really a G with this smoothie shit. <laughs> Ooh, I'm through. We gotta go to Whole Foods because um, I'm running out of groceries. I like doing Whole Foods pickup. I'm scared. I scheduled a pickup, period. Like, what do you mean I don't have to get out the car? Like, 
You made that. Elf? Oh, it's my mommy. Anyway, I met Elf at VidCon. They had a booth there and I went in and introduced myself and we chatted for a little bit. So I actually reached out to them in the DM to be like, hey, like it was nice to talk to you guys. It was nice to talk to blah, 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 and all that. And they reached out later on and sent me a bunch of gifting. So I wanna literally try everything. <laughs> Today we're gonna install that black bust down I was wearing on TikTok a while ago. Why? I loved these glasses the first day I got them. Something is shifting and now I'm starting to hate them. I don't know, I don't know, I don't know. Something's shifting, something's shifting. I thought I looked so cute in these when I first started wearing them. Something's shifting. Is it my hair? Let's let's claw clip it because we're doing like a bunch of stuff anyway, but something is shifting and it's shifting fast. Like I literally couldn't focus on what I was saying because I was like, I look hideous. <laughs> I think the glasses are too dark. I think that I've noticed that dark glasses hide my facial features so much and I'm starting to realize I think that's not great. I think I have a cute face and cute facial features. I don't think I want to hide them. Okay, wait, these are dark too, but they're red. Maybe I like the red, hold on. It is giving grandma, grandma Esther. I feel like we might end up going classic. But when I do this, I look like old and not in a good way. Like I look like 89. <laughs> I kind of want to look like 30 and I look 89. The other ones look more fashionable. The girls might think, shit. The girls might think I'm a fashionista with these. We'll make it work. Okay, we got a lot to try. This is the Untouchable Woe Glow SPF. So I'm assuming it's gonna be a color since it's a glow. Yup, whoa, okay. I'm not doing full fingerfuls of this. She looks like she's gonna give me just enough. Whoa, whoa, whoa. I love the idea of glow sunscreens. The problem is they always sink into my smile lines. The pigment from the sunscreen always sinks into my smile lines. It does look really pretty though. Glow sunscreen to make your skin look so bouncy. Wow. And then pull it down into your neck. Always pull that sunscreen into your neck. Okay, I'm not mad at it. I'm not mad at it. I need to put a pimple patch on this big ass monster on my head. It's literally hurting. The Creme Shop pimple patches are the only ones I trust. It's widowity, hello kitty. Wait there. I don't know why I did that. I kind of just forgot to turn the camera off. We're gonna try the Jelly Pop Primer because I don't know, I kind of believe in her. I don't know, I've heard great things. Like I remember there being like a whole thing like bring the Jelly Pop Primer back. Does it smell like jelly? <gasps> what the hell? Oh my gosh, it smells good. It smells like a Jolly Rancher. It literally smells like a Jolly Rancher. We're witty, witty, witty. Oh, it's thicker than I was expecting. I was not expecting it to be this thick, genuinely. Gagged me a bit. Feels nice. Wait, let me read if they had directions. <laughs> Use fingertips to apply and pat into skin. Oh, now it does say you're supposed to pat it. 30 seconds to absorb and then apply. Let's pretend we didn't rub it everywhere. Now I told y'all I'm not a big primer girl, but then the NYX Marshmallow Primer kind of changed my trajectory, kind of changed my photosynthesis, cause that was good. So I'm down to try primers these days, I am. They didn't send any like foundation, they just sent like dewy drops. So I'm assuming we do our own foundation. Excuse me. Oh my gosh, I never got to try the MAC foundation, remember? I wanted to try a couple videos back. Let me find it. We're gonna try that today. Let's see, we got three shades. Mm -hmm. I feel like two and three mixed together might do something. That might do a little something. Yup. So I needed three. Let's mix four and two and see what that do. That feels like that's gonna match. My face is a little darker because of the strobe sunscreen, but I think this is gonna match. This looks pretty similar. Quim shop sponge. Yeah, that's gonna match. That looks pretty good. Wow, 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 wow. It is a skin tint, it's not foundation, so I guess we're going for a natural look today. Wait, oh my gosh. That's tea. It's giving tea, not this one but it's giving tea. We're gonna use the Hourglass Concealer. I think it's the Veil Concealer. Nope, it's the Vanish. And we're gonna get into some of that. That's gonna be coverage down. Okay, I'm gonna keep it light, I'm gonna keep it light, I'm gonna keep it light. Let's, let's stay there because I feel like if I do two more than that, we're not gonna stay looking natural and cute and glowy. Guys, the, the ZV E10 is amazing. I filmed the blue makeup on that camera and I was just gagged the whole time. The zoom on that lens is deranged. It's so good, it's actually insane. Okay, I'm gonna blend this out and then I'm gonna come back. Um, I guess the natural look vibe is out for today. <laughs> it's giving full face, but you know what? I can't blame one size powder for doing what she, you know what she says she's gonna do. She says she's gonna mattify and mattify she did. I did realize I set my face before trying the dewy drops, but I'm gonna try them anyway and hope that I don't ruin my face. Give me some dew. Is she doing me? Is she giving me some dew? I can't tell. 
I don't think anything's happening. I don't think it's showing up much. I wonder if that's because I've already set my face. This is the KVD Blush Duo Elusive Orchard. This blush is so pretty. When they first showed them to us at the event, I was so gagged. It's just such a pretty shade. I'm using the MAC 16 8S brush. I love her. That is so pretty. Oh my gosh, this makeup is so summer. Okay, we're gonna try the red. We're gonna try the red. I'm so scared. That's pretty. It's very liquidy though. Ooh, it's very, very loose. It's very wet. I don't like when eyeliner is like this. Feels like it'll separate as you're applying. And I'm scared that if I blink too much, it'll transfer. Oh my gosh, I never really wear liquid liner anymore. This is so weird. I did need to go back in a second time because um she was drying out. It's very streaky. Oh, no. Can y'all see that? I don't know if it's open on camera, but there's like... You can like see my skin under. It looks fine. I'm not super pissed, but... I don't know, I don't really like that eyeliner. Like, it's fine. I probably wouldn't use it again. It is making me miss doing colorful eyeliner, though. But I don't really like this one. Elf sent some lip liners. They sent their cream guide lip liners. They sent two shades. Oh my gosh, not the shade names on the top. Spill the tea. Baddie. I can't read it. These two. Let's try both, actually. I'm gonna try one on one side and one on the other. They both look pretty light, though, I'm not gonna lie. Oh my gosh, it is smooth. Glide was the perfect name for that. That literally glided on my face. They're both really light, though. I feel like let's just finish it off for consistency. I am going to go over it with Matte Costa Riche just because I need some, some definition on my lips. The shades are pretty though. They're just too light for me. Mind you, I used to wear red lipstick to school every day. They did send a couple lip products. They sent over their Glow Reviver Lip Oil. Whatever this is, it just says vocal. We also have- Oh, we have a glow stick! We're going to try that on our face first. And we also have another Glow Reviver Lip Oil, but this one's shimmery. Let's try them all. Oh, and there's a Sun Boss Gloss Boss Stretch Broad Spectrum. Let's try the glow stick first. Whoa, okay. Definitely gonna turn this brown for my face. Oh, that's pretty. Oh, wow. Why does everything smell so good? The Jelly Pop stuff smells good AF. Wow, that is very, very glowy. I'm not gonna lie, I don't really love glow sticks. I feel like they just make the stick brown. And I kind of hate that, but... And they also feel like they never show up. It feels like you have to, like, grate it on your face for any pigment. This is cute. I just don't want to, like, wiping it off every time. It's crazy. First, let's try probably the lip oil. Oh, wait, let's see what this is. Okay, this is a lipstick. So, wait, we should try the matte products first. Let's try the lipstick first. Oh, my gosh. I love the look of a fret. I love the look of a fresh lipstick. Mmm. I love the smell of a fr Okay, anyway. Also, don't let the propaganda for that Homika, Homuka vacuum, vacuum vacuum get you. That vacuum sucks, so don't get it. Now, TikTok Shop has some good stuff. That vacuum ain't one of them. Ooh, this is just like that tea shade in that Lancome lipstick that I like. Ooh. Mmm, elf. Give me a kiss. Okay, I feel like let's try the gloss over it. And then let's try the lip oils. Probably gonna have to take this off though. Ooh, this gloss is nice. It's not super thin, but it also doesn't feel heavy on my lips. My lips look so juicy. I wish they sent me a bit more of a pink shade because I don't tend to wear these shades, but I like the gloss enough that I think I'll wear it anyway. Okay, let's take this off so we can try the lip oils. I'm honest. I'm honestly really excited. I'm honestly really excited about the shimmery lip oil. Is it so quick? Instagram post starts in two hours at 12 p.m. From the calendar, Instagram post starts in two hours at 12 p.m. First, let's try the one that's not shimmery. Ooh. Oh my gosh, it smells minty. Oh, see, this is what I'm talking about. I love a pinky shade. Mmm. Even though it's a lip oil, it feels very reminiscent of a gloss and not in a bad way. Ooh, I like that. Damn it. It better not make me not like this one. Let's try Julia Lever. Oh, shit. Elf, are you crazy? You guys are crazy. This is so pretty. I'm taking this in my purse today. <laughs> Everything is so pretty. Oh, we need to put on mascara. Okane kasegu. I need to put the milk eye roller rest, so let's try this Lancome. Can't read that. Whatever this is. Okay. She's making quite the introduction. Oh my gosh, this makeup's gonna look so cool with the black bust down because of the red eye shed. Eye, eye light. Hmm. Okay, I'm not mad at it. It's not making like a super prominent 
impact on lengthening, but it is applying very well. It's applying pretty nice. Like, it feels like a standard mascara, I guess. Finished look is... Oh, that's just my mirror. Finished look. Nothing to be mad about. I definitely overdid the brows, but I ain't that mad at her. Please don't ever make your order when they say they will. Why I put my pickup for noon and one? It's 10.37, they gonna text me. Your order is ready for pickup. I mean, thank you for being early, but like, damn, what happened to... What happened to picking a time? Cause that's the time you gonna have it ready at. Like I'm, I'm not understanding, but I am about to hop in the car and go get it. I'm wondering if I should get ice cream first cause I have time anyway. Where's my phone? I'm gonna check. Well, the problem is Ginger's ice cream has not had my honey comb lavender. So um, that's been pissing me the hell off. So they told me to call them before and see if they have it, which is making me think they're not gonna. Oh, and they are closed. Oh, and they don't open till noon. I'm just gonna get my groceries and shut the hell up. Super crooked, but light drip for Whole Light drip for Whole Foods. And I don't feel like putting a bra on, but I also don't wanna flash the store. So we're gonna wear the going outside jacket. It's the jacket that I keep at the front door. Now I look like somebody's little brother. Oh my gosh, I forgot I had a freaking car tripod and I haven't used it in a while because um, I forgot I had it. Why is my GPS off? Hold on, let me get situated. Why y'all ain't tell me? My hairline was looking like that. That's crazy. I thought we were cool. I thought we had a friendship. I thought we were pals, guys. Why the F word would y'all have me out in these streets looking crazy? Also, my phone is bugging and it's not understanding that I'm not home. I'm actually at Whole Foods Market at the moment and it keeps telling me I'm one minute away from my house, which is factually incorrect. So I'm a little nervous because um, y'all know how to know where the hell I be going. The lights turn right. Never mind, it's working. But anyway, I literally came to tell y'all, no matter what I'm doing, even if I'm driving as safe, as safely as humanly, also, this lotion is not my favorite. It's the Pixie Beauty Skin Treats. I have the rose one. It smells good, but it just doesn't feel like it really moisturizes anything. I've, I've been using it anyway because I'm trying to collect a bunch of empties so I could talk about them all <laughs> for you guys, but wow, I, oh shit. Oh my gosh, this bus almost literally smushed this van to oblivion. It was the van's fault. I don't know why people try buses. That's a bus. That's a bus. That is a bu B U S. That's a bus. You're not gonna win that fight. And when people try it with um 18 wheelers, that's a truck. That's a monster. You're not winning. I just realized. Um, I don't know where the hell I'm going. <laughs> I think I know where I'm going. Not really though. We gonna see, guys. We're gonna make it home. Anyway, anytime a cop car passes by me, I drive, mind you, as it is, I drive like a grandma. I don't play on the road. I feel like a lot of things just aren't worth my life on the road. And I'm just not willing to be like this deranged driver. I drive like a granny. No matter what, I get so incredibly afraid and nervous when I see a cop car. I feel like they're, they're looking at me. They're gonna come get me. They're gonna come get me. They are going to come get me. They're gonna come get me. And that's all I think. And it doesn't go away. What is that? Is that like police anxiety? Is that a thing? I'm so tired. I need a freaking nap. I literally used to say naps were for babies. Ooh, ooh, gaga, like, whoa, like I need to sleep. I've been, I've never been a big napper because I feel as though if I, if I let the nap win, I'm not sleeping that night. And I don't want that. Like I've been trying to fix my sleeping schedule. I mean, I woke up at seven today, so that's good. But I mean, I've been waking up and staying incredibly drowsy for the whole day. So I mean, how much is it really? Oh, there was something weird in the how much is it really, like, you know, helped? Couldn't tell you. I don't know. Bye. I cannot park, y'all. I'm literally in the, the line is in the middle of my car right now, mind you. Okay, wait. Super crooked, but hold on, we're getting somewhere. Huh? Period. I just got home. Do you want to know what's literally been, been rocking my lactose intolerance? And I don't care. Bubby's Mochi. Mind you, I've already eaten the three that I bought two days ago. They are so good. They're so good. The mochi is so good. I've been demolishing it. So much so that Joni made me buy lactate and Pepto-Bismol. Let that tell you where I've been. This is Alfonso Mango. I haven't tried any of their sweet flavors or fruity, I guess. Ooh, like look at them. O-M-G. I hope it's tardy. Hmm. It's not tarty at all, it's very sweet, which if you know me, you know I don't like sweet things, but it tastes so fresh, I don't mind. Would I buy it again? 
No, I'm gonna stick to the ones I buy from them. But it's not bad. If you like a sweet mango moment, you'll love this. And that mochi is just so good. This is so good. Look at her. That's beauty. Hey, I am green, partially. It looks so cute. I'm gonna go try putting in my black contacts to make my eyes look freaking humongous. And I know the wig color's not accurate. Don't start. Um, the one I got looked crazy. Having to go to the grocery store like this is, is, is crazy. I need solution and I guess you can't pick up contact solution on any app? Like what the- We're gonna put in the black contacts. Well, I think they're dark brown, but I'm scared. Oh my gosh, being at the store with this makeup on was, was definitely something. I do not like being stared at and I mean, Understandably people stared, but it was just freaking me out, but I kind of I had to get the contact solution even if um It wasn't gonna work for the look. I had no solution left and I think I had to film stuff tonight and tomorrow I don't remember if these are the ones that I tried a couple years ago a couple years ago I got some I don't think so. There's no way I kept contacts that long and I'm about to put it in my eye I guess we'll find out in a second. Oh, no, they're folding. Please Stop. Oh, I think they're old That burned really bad. I don't know if it's because it's flipped or because it's old. I'm gonna flip it and try again if it burns. If it burns, they're old. Ah! Oh, they burn, man. I really wanted to wear those. No worries. I already have big brown eyes. Always down to inhale the ginger chew. Okay. Mm-hmm. Delicacy. Now that's class and sass and ass. Ass the class. Oh my gosh, I look like Jim Carrey in the mask. I look so tea. We're gonna wash this off. I'm gonna show you that it's all gonna come off with the Dove Beauty Bar. I don't think people believe me because I've worked with them that I've been using this soap since I was like a teenager. I remember when I told my mom I got the brand deal, she was like, the soap we use all the time? I said, yes, girl. <laughs> like, I promise you she's tea. We never met, but she's all I see at night. We're gonna use my run down Dove Beauty Bar. I need some, 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 some. Don't look at my butt if you can see it. Let me get some of these. Cause the eyes might be a little harder to get off, but I don't know, I'm pretty confident. I do still have my contacts. No, it's fine, it's fine, it's fine, it's fine, it's fine. Let's take this soap, let me take this. We're gonna lather her up real freaking good. Now I have a very, very horrible impulse every time to open my eyes. I'm trying to fight it. I'm trying to fight it. I'm trying to fight it. No, 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 no. That shit burns. It shit. It, it burns. It burns. It burns. I don't actually open it enough for it to burn, but I know it will. Now it's rinse. Ooh. Me when I didn't put any soap on my forehead. Oh my gosh, I forgot about my body. I'm gonna just have to shower to get it all off. <gasps> my shower's white. No, it's fine. It's fine. It's fine. It's fine. It's fine. I wonder how much of this I can wash off in the sink. I'm actually gonna try to wash off most of this in the sink. <laughs> I forgot to turn the camera back on and show you guys, but um, now it's gone. Why is this the best I've ever looked? Nails I've liked the most as of recent. Like, are you kidding me? All my nails, I'll put the name here. She freestyled these for me. Let me, let me sit y'all down. Like the hair is hairy, like, and the booty's booty. Hold on, is it, is it actually? Okay, the booty's booty. Hold on. Anyway, okay, so all my nails, I found her on Etsy one day because I was looking for sellers that make their nails. I feel as though a lot of these Etsy sellers are not making these nails. All my nails makes her nails. She had no reviews, I think no sales. And I was like, oh, I'm coming for you, babes. I like you already. I ordered a set from her or two and then they were a little thin. So I left a review, but I left her five stars because the nails were beautiful and they were very creative. And she literally was like, oh my gosh, I'll make them thicker. Like what's tea? And I was like, her, so. Then she sent me a new, well then I ordered another set, but then UPS like lost them. So she had to make me another set. And oh my gosh, they're the same ones I got last time, but they were gray last time. And I wanted some, I wanted me a little more girly. So I got pink. Then I got these like seashell, like beach mermaid nails. Then I got these for Valentine's day. The thumbnails are a little bigger than they should be. So I'll tell her and I'll just order some more from her. And then these ones she freestyled like, I'm gagged, babe, scogged. And why are these earrings from Taobao so good? They're literally on Taobao. I love that damn app. Anyway, look at these pictures I just took, see, hold on. I have so much to tell y'all, cause I was too lazy to bring my vlog camera out, so now I gotta show y'all a million things. Look at these pictures that I just took. Are you literally joking? Gagging myself, actually. Like, I just gagged and it's me and it's my face. Like, I need to kiss her. And the her in question, um, I know her and it's me.
Like, come on. Anyway, 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 that was not why I came here. I don't remember why I came here, I'm not gonna lie. But I've been loving Dress to Impress. I'm literally about to go play it right now. I'm gonna play myself into a hole. No, I'm not gonna speak it into existence. I was gonna say I was gonna play myself into a place of not wanting to play it anymore because I play it too much. But I'm not gonna say that. I mean, I just said it. Lotion like this makes me feel like this. What's up, shorty? Hold on. What's up, shorty? Like, what's... What's good with you? I saw you over here putting gas in your car, minding your business, and I thought, why not come bother you and waste your time and ruin your day by talking to you and being a man and being scary? What's up with you? That's how I perceive y'all at the gas station, by the way. I told y'all that story about that man that literally got in my car at the club. Okay, bye. Okay, we just finished playing Dress to Impress, and I have little to no poison because we were having a time. I got this rice cooker on top <laughs> But because it's a Chinese appliance, it does not work with my outlet. Some of their stuff does come with a, like the standard American plugs, but this one did not. So I thought, it says it's a universal adapter. So I'm hoping it fits. I think it's gonna fit, hold on. Yes, it fit. I can actually use it. Now the thing, everything is in Chinese. However, that's literally how I talk to the sellers on Taobao. I literally be on Google with my translate, copy it and paste it and send it over. I'm really loving how much my space is coming together. I'm gonna say my space is coming together. <laughs> how much my space is coming together. I love it, love it, love it. I also got this on Taobao. It's so cute. I literally am drinking water out of it. I loved them when I bought them. Looked at them a little bit later on and hated them. And now I love them again. I look so classy. Imagine if I had both earrings in. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm, mm-hmm. And. These are delicious. Whole Foods really got some like random great shit. Last thing I'm gonna show you. <laughs> then I got this crown for stream. It's so cute. Uh -uh. Oh, this is really the last thing. I got vent covers because I don't want no bugs up in my spot. And if you listening, you need to be paying rent. And if you're not, there's the door. So that's all I'm saying. AJ hers need to up on the top floor because I got the blood. I took down the art that I had here because I got it on Etsy and I got it from searching up Barbados because I wanted bitch and art, but I don't know, I started to look at it more and it just didn't look like Barbados. And I messaged the seller and I was like, hey, where is this in Barbados? I asked him, I was like, where in Barbados is this? Ignored me. And I was like, okay, that's telling me it's giving random Google search <laughs> to a random place that you, I don't know, found and were like, that looks close enough. And I don't like that. So I went back and I looked for another one that actually felt like it looked more like Barbados to me. So I'm gonna show you. I don't know if I even like really showed you guys the ones I had before, but you can probably see them like in the background of a video somewhere. I'm gonna surprise you. I'm gonna surprise you. So um, you just wait there. Okay. Ta-da! This look like Barbados to me. This is what the other ones need to look like. Island gal, island gal, me a Dominican gal, bilingual. Me no follow the albino. This is so good. This is the Barbados. I know. The other ones just looked like, I don't know. When I looked at them, I was like, this does not feel like I'm back home. These feel like I'm back home. I literally didn't use a leveler at all putting these up, so girl, they probably all crooked. Okay, let's do the other two. I'll show you all the last one when I sit down. Anyway, Alani New sent me some more stuff. And they sent their gum candy. They're good. I never had them before. I think Polokai said she really likes them. They look like trees. I feel like a little Christmas tree. I was about to get in the shower, but I wanted to braid my bust down with y'all. You can't even see it, but it's literally down to like the top of my ass. Um, I think what I'm gonna do is, I have an event tomorrow and I would like to look like this tomorrow because I don't know, I look really good, I think. And I think only over here does need some fixing. So I'm thinking I might just leave it alone tonight and then fix it tomorrow because I don't know, I feel like if it's gonna look like that, it's gonna look like that. We're gonna use the unbrush. I have the cute like periwinkle color. It's so cute. And then I'm gonna use my TPH Ride or Die Leave-In Conditioner because the bottom is matting up already. She's she's starting to go and it's day one and I just washed it. So I'm just gonna try to keep it as loose as possible so I don't have to cut it because I like how long it is. So we're just gonna put that everywhere and then start at the bottom. Start with your hands. And I like to, when I brush my hair or do my hair to be honest, in general, I like to do it in one 
spot so that I know exactly where I need to vacuum after. I don't like vacuuming up hair just because I hate cleaning hair out of the bottom of the vacuum, but sitting there with a dustpan and broom trying to get a back um, hair off the flip, like no man, no. I should have used a white tube comb. This is working, not because it's like not detangling, just because it's a brush, so it's, I don't know, I feel like it's like taking me longer. Wow, that actually helped the ends a lot. I don't think I've used the TPH on a synthetic wig yet, so I kind of didn't really know what would happen. I've only used it on my real hair, but I use it a lot. I should have known I could twice to a Like, look at that. She's so silky and smooth. I laid the hair over my boob and then brushed it, and that hurt. Ow! What I will say is what I've noticed about dark wigs is they bring out my complexion a lot more, and I like it. That's the one downfall of blonde wigs. Most of the time when you're in front of something or you have something lighter, you tend to look... I'll just use hair as an example. When you, If I have white hair, I'm going to probably look... Actually, it's the opposite, so maybe I'm just tan. And I just like it. Cause I was, I, as I was talking, I realized, wait, no, it's backwards. Like if you're wearing lighter colors, you're gonna look darker. And then if you're wearing darker colors, you're gonna look lighter, but I think I'm just tan. Like, I think I'm just tan right now. I used to get really tan when we were in Barbados, but it doesn't really happen anymore. Also don't go outside that much anymore. Maybe if I have an outside more, I'd get more of a um, real tan. It's just, oh my gosh, look how she's just combing through now. I don't really go outside. Anytime I go to anything outside, it's like an event. The most outside I get is when I um, walk outside to go to an Uber and when there's an outside portion at an event. I gotta get out more. But in Barbados, hot AF and always outside. That is silky. Okay, let's braid it before she even gets a chance. Actually, I'm gonna pack some of this on first. I don't wanna give her a chance to even mat up before tomorrow because I wanna wear it down tomorrow. Had an o'clock clip today because I was streaming and I knew I get wild and crazy and I'd be running around and doing all sorts of shit on stream. So I was like, oh, she's definitely gonna get matted. So let me put her up, but tomorrow I wanna wear it down. So she needs to be able to survive a car ride. And there's a lot of rides tomorrow because I have two events to go to. We got a bit, guys, we're booked and busy. Like this is our summer. This is the pookie summer. We're booked and busy. Honestly, I'm gonna tell y'all some tea right now. I'm really grateful for the team that I have behind me, just because, to be honest with you, I was not doing very well financially as a creator mm, a couple years ago, and I think two, like two years ago, whenever it was that I found my managers, and I just wasn't doing good, I wasn't getting grand deals, and I was doing creating full time, so that is a problem. <laughs> I did not have another job to like fall back on. I was only a creator while working a regular job for a very brief time frame because I left my nine to fives. Oh my gosh. I'm literally realizing that all the decorations and the charms on my nails are like getting in the way of the braiding and it's pissing me off. Okay, um, I didn't realize, or when I was working my nine to fives, I left them before I started to really become like a creator creator. So I never really did the nine to five and creator jazz at the same time, to be honest. Briefly, but not really. And not having a, a real job to fall back on. This is a real job. It does feel like a real job now that I work one full time. Like now that I do it full time, like, like I have like a business with being a creator and stuff like that. So now it feels legit, but then it did not feel legit because it just reminded me how inconsistent being a creator was. A lot of the time, to tell y'all the truth, sometimes you get like a whole bunch of brand deals as a creator, like back to back, back to back, back to back. And sometimes you get none, like for months. Sometimes it's real quiet. Sometimes it's for weeks, sometimes it's for days. Like it's just so consistently inconsistent. And I just wasn't do, oh, there's no way this wig is staying on for longer than like two days. It's really pretty, but this is a bitch to braid. Um, it's just long as hell. So anyway, what was I saying? I don't remember. Period. I'm gonna come back when I'm done, child. I need to watch something. My braids are done, they're so long. I gotta go shower my teeth.